Greetings friends. This video is about gaining a realization. Some call it a knowing. As I did for a long time. In order to gain a fuller comprehension in this regard. One must first gain a better understanding of how this universe really works. When you move from this life into the next. You pass through a parallel existence. This parallel existence, is where you, the real you, originated. The you, that has been many places, over many lifetimes. The eternal, and indestructible you. In between lives, which can be a short time, or what would seem to us, as a very long time, because of our expiration dates, and our separation from the source, which translates into what we identify as time. This intermediate existence has no such time. Because you have had many lifetimes, you have had many loved ones, children, parents, brothers, sisters, extended family and friends, all return to this intermediate existence between lives, where all memories return from all lives. Just like in this 3D existence, there are choices to be made. For personal development never stops. So you see, you could potentially have thousands of loved ones watching you. Who are still in the intermediate realm. Some are able, due to their personal development, to assist you, with positive emotions slash vibrations. These are your guides. So, as you go through this life, they are watching encouraging, sometimes communicating, depending on your level of development. Also understand that there are others as well, those of higher development, other species, some human some not, who are also able to tap in. Yes, they can answer questions, but often, only specific questions. Because the very fact, that you are asking the question, means you are seeking further development, more awareness. After all, the questioner is responsible for what they want to know. So with that, how does one connect with their guides? Well, some come into this life more developed, due to more lives or better choices in said lives, hence more development. More development means higher frequency, which means more brain activation. Where this brain activation is, or how it executes itself, depends on your awareness. Remember, we are talking about the real you, the one that has access, and is using this current solid matter body, with all its advantages and limitations, all for the purposes of personal and individual development. So, Think of development, as gaining skills. When one practices, they become more familiar and better at the desired skills. They become more confident with their abilities, with said skills. They learn intuitively, to trust, what they now, know. This is development. It's important, to accept this realization as such. Once this is done, there's no reason to ever look back. It's now. A new you. Development can be undone by doubt. Do not allow this. Your own intellect or ego would prefer, you not discover these abilities. Your intellect, is simply an accumulation of environmentally imposed ideals, often including false untrustworthy information. Learn to move past your intellect, trusting your heart. For it will never lead you astray. How do you move from intellect, to heart center? I have found that one of the best ways, is simply to think of something that makes you smile, something that has brought pure joy into your current life. In the beginning you may find associated photos helpful. This will move you away from intellect, instantly. The more you practice this, the faster and longer you'll be able to hold the frequency, that allows you to explore, and expand, 
new, and higher frequency abilities. Now you are ready to ask your questions. It's important to be very specific with your questions, so that when the answer is offered, you will be more likely to recognize it. The answer can come in many ways, depending on your intuitive ability. Another reason for the need to be so specific, is because this is about your personal development. You are likely only ready for the answer in a very specific manner. There is much to learn, and the acceptance of the further reality, depends on what you have been able to accept as your current reality. Learn to be an observer of your own life. This way you will recognize the influence of your guides. It's an amazing, and beautiful thing to watch. When you are on the correct path or pursuing an assigned task, you will see that things will happen that are helpful. You will see how doors will open, the path will become more clear, showing that you are on the correct path. Your guides will navigate. If you allow. And wish it to be so. These are some of my realizations. I hope they will help you gain your own. For I was compelled in a very powerful way to share it with you. Remember. Facts are facts. Being stuck in a very limited, imposed belief paradigm is a choice. A very unnecessary one. Cheers.